the punch for kids is being held this Saturday. It uses ultimate fitness training to fight childhood obesity. In turn, the kids will learn self-esteem, self-confidence, and establish discipline and a more secure future. Uh, joining me this morning are two friends, Danny Calhoun, boxer, also co-owner of the Punch House, and Taiwan Hagler, a linebacker with the Indianapolis Colts. They both played for UC, and that is when they became friends. Gentlemen, first of all, thank you very much for joining us. Well, thank you. Danny, I'm going to start with you. First of all, nice seeing you again, and nice to see all the success you're running into. Thank you. Uh, let's talk about the Punch House. What is the Punch House? How is that different than a gym? Well, the Punch House, you uh, can release a lot of stress. Yeah? Throwing punches. We also have Muay Thai, um, self-defense, and uh, uh, we have uh, uh, MMA training. Well, I'm going to ask them to rerun that video again because it seems pretty intense. Yeah, it is. Uh -huh. But anybody can do it, though. Okay. Any beginner can come in and just learn those same techniques. And um, what you're saying right now, that's a couple of drills that we put people through, conditioning drills. And with these drills and what they're able to do in the ring, do you think they build confidence in themselves, do things yeah. that they didn't think they could do? You definitely feel a little bit more secure with yourself because you're physically stronger. Uh -huh. So you're not as timid when you're walking around. You're not intimidated by anybody because you're definitely learning techniques that can, you can use anywhere to protect yourself. And Taiwan, I mean, you play in the NFL, which is like the top of success in terms of what you do. How important was physical fitness to you in terms of making it to where you are right now? It was, it was great. It, it plays a, um, a major factor in what I do as a linebacker. Uh -huh. I need fast hands to um, in order to get linemen off me and make plays. So, you know, it's a great thing. It gets you in great shape, like I told Danny. That's one of the best workouts I've been through, and it's helping me out tremendously. What does it say? What does it do for your mind? Because a lot of it is mental, yeah, right? A lot of it is mental. It makes you more crisp. I don't worry about anything. I just worry about my assignment. I don't worry about my body, or right. about injuries, anything like that. I just worry about. I know I got confidence. I know I'm going to get my job done. So I just focus on the play. And and what does it do? And we see uh, women and girls in these pictures. Uh, the event that you're having this weekend on Saturday. Tell me about it. Who is it for? What is it designed to do? Well, we're, we're trying to reach out to the Cincinnati youth. Uh, Michelle Obama put together a good campaign called Let's Move. Right. And it's against childhood obesity. So what we're trying to do is expose children that don't have the funds to afford this type of training that Taiwan's getting right. and all of my other clients. We're trying to give them a free service every Wednesday from 4 to 6. The kickoff is going to be Saturday from 12 to 2. And there's going to be an autograph signing. Taiwan will be there signing autographs and a couple other professional athletes. So a lot of parents who are watching this morning, they should bring their kids on by this bring Saturday. Bring kids. Enjoy. What do, you, what do you think, especially, what do you think it can do for these kids in terms of their future? I think it'll show kids a different route than what they see out here on the right. streets. You know, they get them in there, they get physically fit. We really pretty much talk to them about everything in every aspect of life, but definitely get, make sure, you know, fight childhood obesity. You know, you can find out more information at fox19.com. Uh, Danny Calhoun, Taiwan, nice job at making a difference in young people's lives. All the best to you. Thanks. Thank you.